Hello everyone, today we're going to be going over a 20 minute martial arts workout hosted by me, Gino Francisco. We're going to start off with some neck circles, we're going to go both directions, we're going to make sure our posture is straight and that we're breathing. Next we're going to go into shoulder rolls, we're going to go backwards first and then we're going to go into a reverse direction and bring the shoulder circles going forward. Let's give it a shot right here, just like so. Next, we're going to move into arm circles. So you're going to take one arm, the right arm on this case, and make big arm circles going forward. Do that a few times, and then we're going to go reverse direction. We're going to do the same thing with the other arm, going forward. Big arm circles, keep your back straight, and reverse. Make sure you're breathing through all the movements as well. After this, we're going to take both arms out and we're going to go over unders or arm scissors. We're going to switch every time, left arm on top to right arm on top. Let those arms swing. Make sure you're staying relaxed, shake it out afterwards. Now we're going to do some arm raises going off at the side. Going up all the way. One arm up, one arm down. Afterwards, we'll go into straight arms up, right in front. Again, lifting one at a time, relaxing your shoulders. Shake it out, and now we're going to go into some torso twists. So you're going to pick your arms up and your elbows, twist that upper body, make a tight fist, go from one side to the other side. Hands and hips, hip circles. In one direction, then reverse. We're gonna go forward and back motion. Side to side. And you're gonna shake it out. So shake those legs out. Next, we're going to high knees. Just bring your knees up to the chest, one at a time, getting your legs warmed up. Afterwards, we'll go into heel ups or butt kickers, I call them. So bring your heels to your butt, one at a time. We're gonna move into lateral steps. So you're gonna step to the side, toes gonna become behind the heel. So step to the side, and we're gonna finish off with 10 small jumps, shaking the arms out. Just like so. Now we got one minute to rest. So. We're gonna do three minute rounds with one minute rest in between. Use the minute rest to grab water, breathe, and shake it out. Our next exercises are gonna be imaginary jump rope, jumping jacks, and some windmills. That's gonna be three exercises. We're gonna do all of them for one minute each. So again, one minute of each exercise, starting off with the imaginary jump rope. If you have a real jump rope, you can use that as well. But right now, we're just going to Use our imagination, get an imaginary um, skip with the rope. So you gotta synchronize your hands and feet. Every time your hands come down, you're gonna get a little hop as if you're throwing a rope under your feet. All right, about 15 more seconds. Let's get ready to go. Shake it out if you need to. All right, here we are, feet together. Hands up, ready, set, and go. Now, again, if you have a jump rope, if you have the space to skip, then go ahead and go for the jump rope. But if you don't, imaginary jump rope works great. It's still a good cardio workout. Here's a different angle for you. Again, notice how my arms are drawing the circles. Every time my hands go down, my feet jump. You want to keep your back straight. Uh, you can do different variations of skips if you know them. If you know different types of ways to jump rope, that's perfectly fine. You can use your own way to skip the rope as if uh, you're skipping or you want to do one leg hops side to side hops totally up to you I'm starting to skip the rope here in the video now next uh, we're gonna go into jumping jacks so 
jumping jacks is going to be the next set of exercises. Let's get ready to go. Check it out. All right. So you're going to synchronize again, hands and feet. When the hands are at your side, your feet should be together. When your hands are over your head, your feet should be apart. Now, one minute's a long time to do jumping jacks. So take your time. Don't rush it. If you're feeling a little tired, just shake it out. Come right back to it. Try not to stay out too long. We want to try to stay active for the full three minute round. So we'll keep going with the jumping jacks. Here's some few angles for you. 20 more seconds. Keep it up. Now, next, we're going to go into windmills. So, the windmill position is going to be hands and feet apart. Try to touch your opposite hand with your opposite toe. Right, so hands and feet apart. So my left hand goes to my right foot and my right foot goes to my left hand. Now I come up all the way on these windmills. Don't stay down, don't stay with your back punched over. Try to come all the way up straight, touch the toes, come up. More seconds. Keep those legs straight, keep those arms straight, and your back straight. Hinge at your waist, come down. Again, don't forget to breathe. I remind all my students, remember to breathe. Ten more seconds. We are in five, four, three, two, one. Time, good job.